Aaron, how you doing? Doing well? Hope you're doing well. Give it a couple minutes. Let everybody get in, and then we'll start the break. Uh, this is a three hobby box break of 2024 Tops Heritage. Uh, this break was a true pick your own team. Uh, most of my breaks usually are uh, I do the uh, pick one team, get two random team formats, and then usually I'll lock like the Reds or depending on whatever release is going on or what year, I usually lock the best team or two. Um, so they're guaranteed to be in the randoms. So everybody has a shot at those. But uh, this one we actually did as a true pick your team. And uh, well, we'll see what we get. I personally haven't opened up any hobby boxes in this product yet. Uh, I did open up a little bit of the retail, uh, which I got two videos out currently. Uh, I had a nice auto out of, um, out of a hanger box, which I was very pleased about. But uh, uh, I personally haven't opened up any of the hobby boxes yet. So this will be my first in-person look at uh, the hobby format. Uh, I do it on Instagram. I post my breaks currently on Instagram, Aaron. Got one for my birthday. Pulled a uh, Dominguez, a 999, and a white border Ellie. That's not bad. Can't complain about that, Cole. Happy birthday, by the way. That's not. That's uh, that's two decent pulls. Did you end up getting a relic, then, as uh, your hit? Because I know it's like usually. Usually, it's like per case. It's like maybe three autos, or at least in past years, that's kind of how it's usually been. It's been like three. It's like one in every three boxes you usually get like an auto. Um, I uh, I personally haven't. Uh, yeah, that's I'd I'd take it. Yeah, I'd be I'd be okay with that personally. Usually, if it's my biggest thing is as long as the you know even if I get a, a relic, which I know the relics aren't as exciting, um, but. Uh, you know, with the relics, uh, I uh, usually, at least if it's a player I like, I'm like, all right, it is what it is. Um, but, uh, you know, it's, it is what it is. Um, And the biggest thing, too, is also, too, with those relics, usually as long as, uh, um, I always like it, at least when it's not a white napkin, either. As long as it's uh, at least a colored jersey or, you know, even if you get something where there's a little bit of, uh, um, you know, a little something extra to the, to the relic. But, Walker, what's going on? We'll give it another two minutes, and then we'll get ripping. Definitely going to buy in the next break. I appreciate that, Aaron. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure what I got lined up uh, for the next break. I know we're kind of in that, you know, that lull of uh, releases are a little bit far and few in between right now. Um, I'm not a big person. I'm not one to, that's going to be breaking, like, any of the high-end products. Uh, I, I do this for fun, the breaks. Um, and... Uh, um, you know, I don't really go too, too crazy with some of the high-end products, you know, like, uh, what was it, like, Tribute just came out or whatever. Um, you know, that's something, like, me personally, like, I'll buy some singles for myself uh, with those with those particular products. Um, but uh, I usually don't do too many high-end breaks. Uh, we'll do, you know, some of the, the base, you know, releases. We'll definitely do Bowman when that comes out. Um, I think on... I think it's May, May 9th, I think it's when Bowman comes out, which, or 8th, whatever it is, so I might have, I'm, and actually, too, I'm actually going on vacation a few days after, so we'll see. Um, so, but anyway, uh, with that, let's get going. Uh, you know, this was a true pick-your-own-team. 
So hopefully the participants that are in the break remember what their teams are. Uh, for some reason, if any of the participants forget their teams, I can uh, pull that up for you. Um, cause I didn't really, I didn't make my normal spreadsheet like I normally do just because of, uh, this being a true pick your team, but yeah. So, all right, let's get into it. It's two after. Um, so like I said, this is a true pick your own team, three hobby boxes of Topps Heritage Baseball, uh, all cards ship, even base hits, everything, all ships, box toppers, all that good stuff. Everything gets shipped out. So, so with that. Best of luck, everybody, and hopefully, hopefully we can get at least one auto. So, all right, we got a box topper. We got one of our buyback cards, Ken Holtzman. That'll be going to the A's. Ken has hurled two no-hitters. Okay. So, one of the uh, 50th anniversary buyback cards. Centering definitely is a little, little rough top to bottom, but that's all right. So I'll throw that up there for now. And like I said too, with the uh, the Heritage Baseball, they threw they threw me for a loop with the uh, the changing of the uh, the format where the short prints are at the beginning of the set, uh, cards one through one hundred. Not the traditional 401 to uh, 500. Christian, what's going on? We're just getting started. So, so with that, best of luck, everybody. And hopefully we can pull some good stuff. Start us off. We got a Brayu. Cabrian Hayes. Lane Ramsey. Uh, World Series. Oh, and then also two for... The league leader cards, it will the card will go to the actual league leader. Uh, the um, the then and now cards, uh, will the uh, those inserts they will go to the current team, and uh, we'll do a random for any of the world event cards, uh, at the end. Um, and then I'm trying to think what else we got, I'm trying to think if there's anything else might come up oh and then the uh the the ones with the two mvps if we pull dupes i'll send one to each of you guys um i mean it's just the base card but uh we got world series 2023 game four jose barrios basabe we got clark schmidt baseball flashbacks robin yell breaks mel ott's 47 year old record and kyle bradish All right, here we go. Pack number two. I'm trying to think if there's any other oddball cards that are usually in Heritage that I can't think of off the top of my head. We got William Contreras, Hagen Danner, Alejandro Kirk, Taylor Colby. I believe I pronounced that right. We got Bryce Miller, Tyler Rogers, Julio, Frank, uh, Julio Rodriguez, excuse me. And then we get our first short print, Patrick Santoval. And Nolan Chanel for the Angels. So, Santa Ball, our first short print. A lot of sleeving I'll do off camera just to save some time on the break. Uh, I'll do some sleeving, obviously, on camera for cards that should be sleeved right then and there. But a lot of the rookies and such will get sleeved and, you know, off camera. We got Kyle Stowers, Cano. We got Hunter Goodman, Victory Leaders. Uh, we got Strider had the most, uh, wins, so that'll go to the Braves. Corbin Burns, Corey Lee, Chris Stratton, Gregory Soto, and Brian Bello. And just double check. I think it's usually the second to last card is going to be the hit, if there is a hit in the pack. Strider out for the season. Yes, he is. <coughs> That's a shame. It's a big blow for the uh, the Braves. We got Christopher Morel, Conforto, Christian Walker, Zach Remlard, Garrett Cole, Emerson Hancock, Alec Bohm. We got New Age performers Justin Steele and Hassan Kim. Floating heads, what's going on? Hope you're doing well. We're about four packs in so far. 
We got Edgar Navarro, Ryan Mountcastle, Kikuchi, Jacob Young, we got Brandon Woodruff, Heston Kerstad, Alec Burleson, and just a short print, Luis Patino, and Austin Meadows. Definitely some of the bottoms of the cards are a little rough on this product this year. But hopefully everybody had a good weekend. Weekend's winding down. We got Nico Horner, Davis Schneider, World Series Game 3, Story Ruiz, Mark Kana, Robbie Grossman. We got a Chrome coming up. We got Jason DeLay behind that. All right, behind that, we got a base Ellie. Definitely a little bit of a rough on the bottom there. And our Chrome Angels, Reed Detmers. That is going to be to 575. So let me go into the Angels. Chrome does look sharp, though, at this year's. Chrome refractors. So, yep. Literally just said that myself. Floating heads. Yep. No, the... I mean, the 75... I don't know. There's something about it just wasn't my favorite... My most favorite design. Like, I don't hate it. I don't love it, though, either. Um, but the chromes do look very sharp. We got Stolen Base Leaders 2023, which I believe is Ruiz, if I'm not mistaken. No, I'm sorry, Acuna. Acuna actually had more Stolen Bases. So that'll go to the Braves. We got Joey Manessis, Mike Moustakis, uh, World Series Game 2, Jeremy Pena, Caminero, Alaska Design of the Vintage. Okay. Sade Sacconi, and we got a white. Cole Reagans, and then batting leaders. Uh, that is going to be Lu uh, Luis Arias. So white border, Cole Reagans. And Caminero. All right, let's see what we got next pack. Dalton Varshow, Gray Kessinger, Kyle Leary, Sparky Anderson, Brian Reynolds, Jesus Lazardo, Patrick Bailey, Short Print, Comello Delval for the Giants, and Marte for the Reds. I don't know, for me, there, there was a lot of 80s designs I actually liked. Or at least the earlier 80s. Uh, we got 2022 Most Valuable Players. Like I said, if we get two of these, one will go to the Yankees, one will go to the Cardinals. Um, I also got some dupes, so um, I can even that out if need. Uh, God dip, watch the rest on replay. Yep, no, no, no problem, Cole. Take it easy. Luis Arias, Bryce Elder, Paul Goldschmidt, Yuri Perez, Scooball. We got leading fireman. Uh, let's see, that would be Class A. Contreras, white border. And Salvador Perez. We got Kevin Gossman. Parker Meadows. Hunter Brown, Spencer Horwitz, Willie Adams, Jordan Lawler, 2017 Most Valuable Players, Altuve and Stanton. Then we got Mitch Keller, Pirates, and Nestor Cortez. Keller, Keller being a short print. Yelich, Darvish. We got 57 most valuable players Mantle and Hank Aaron. Drew Waters, Manuel Valdez, 
Dane Myers, Buxton, Riley Green, and Trello. And the Riley Green is a image variation. That's why I like to check those. I always like to still check the card just in case. So Riley Green, second year card, image variation. Uh, I think it's just a, yeah, it's just a, it's an image variation. It's not an error. So I know, what is it? Uh, I know there's some error cards of Corbin Carroll, which I, he doesn't have the rookie cup on it. <coughs> Excuse me. That's the error on it. But the uh, Riley Green is just a regular image variation for the Tigers. We got Oswaldo Cabrera, Brendan Donovan. Hernandez, Schwarber, J.P. Sears, Trent Grisham. He just looks, he just looks completely different with that mustache. Uh, Spencer Strider, New Age Performers, Adley Rutschman, and AL Champions Rangers. Obviously, those cards will go to the, the respective teams that are on the card as well. 71 most valuable players, Vita Blue, Joe Torre, Tommy Edmond, Ronnie Mauricio, Will Benson, Candelario, Tuki Tersant, James Altman, then we got Duran, and Corbin Carroll. Yeah, I think his, I think his, his uh, error card doesn't have the rookie cup, if I'm not mistaken. It's a tough one to pull, too. It's like 4,400 packs or something like that, I think. Odds of uh, pulling pulling one of those. We got Taylor Ward, Stephen Kwan, Henry Davis, Ben Attendi. We got 75 most valuable players. Fred Lynn, Joe Morgan, Enrique Hernandez, Matt Burling, Taj Bradley, no, nothing on that. Just a regular old base. And then Bobby Miller. Blake Sable. Colton Kowser. Jacob Lopez. Gabriel Moreno. Michael Lorenzen. Tejon Walker. Carlos Correa. And news flashbacks. Sony launches Betamax, Betamax in Japan. And Robert Garcia. Eloy, Jordan Adams, Pereira, Brett Beatty, Andres Jimenez, Lance Lynn, Ian Happ, then we got Luis Servino for the Mets, and Reed Schoenheist. Luis being a short print. We got Charlie Blackman, Alex Lang, Alex Jacob, Ben Joyce, Riley Adams, Jorge Soler, and there is our first uh, relic, Andres Jimenez, Matthew Liebertor behind that. Andres Jimenez, like talking about the relics earlier, like this would be one I'd be happy with because uh, this is one of those guys that I, I do PC a little bit. As much as... Uh, it's nice that the Mets got Lindor. I was sad to see him get traded in that deal, but, um, you know, to get Lindor, I completely understand it. So that is our first hit of the three boxes. We got Jackson Wolf, Jose Ramirez, Earl Weaver, Devers, Matt McLean, Kiebert Ruiz, Nick Lofton, we got New Age Performers, Kershaw, and Dominic Fletcher. We got Ryder Ryan, Austin Riley, Will Smith, Jose Fermine, Otani, Cedric Mullins, George Serrano. Then we got Then and Now, 
like I said, this will go to the uh, Braves. We'll do the current pitcher or current player. And Mookie Betts. Just so I'm not doing randoms on multiple inserts. You really have to give an update on the surface uh, once you shine the light on them. Yeah, I, you can tell they're definitely a little rough in some areas. We got Devin Sweet, uh, Dusty Baker, Zach Gilloff. And we got most valuable players, Trout and Bellinger from 2019. D.L. Hall, Brad Hand, Nick Madrigal, Baseball Flashbacks, first rookie to win ALV, AL MVP award. Fred Lynn. But, I mean, you can tell with the way they're cut and stuff like that. They're definitely rough, you know, all along the edge. Uh, we got, what, Trout and Chris Bryant, 2016, most valuable players. We got Framber Valdez, Castillo, Josh Young. Shame to see him get hurt. Colin Silby, Cole Reagans, Hunter Green. Luciano, and another short print, Brian Rocchio, and Reed Detmers. I mean, yeah, you definitely could tell bottom of that Detmers. It's a little hard to see, I think, on camera, but uh, definitely these are going to be some cards that they're going to be uh, very tough to grade if you're looking to grade. But just like any of the cards from this time period, I mean, they're very hard to get graded really well. Davis, uh, David Hamilton, Rizzo, Sean Murphy, Verdugo. It's crazy seeing him in the Yankee uniform and the, uh, the facial hair. Brent Rooker, Perdomo, Andrew Heaney. We got Jose Suas, just the regular base, and McNeil. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I don't know about, like, the modern stuff, uh, you know, that's supposed to have that vintage feel or look to it. Um, I, might, I don't know how crazy they are about that. Like, I, I understand, especially the cards, you know, that were made, you know, 25 years ago or more. Uh, actually, no, I should, take that, I should take that back. Cards that are made, like, you know... 50 years ago and such like that. Like, I get it then, but, like, I don't know. You figure, you'd, you'd feel like, I know they just want to give this, 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 like, vintage feel, but you'd think they'd still try to, you know, clean it up a little bit. We got Rojas, Scherzer, Angel Flippy, Yogi Bear, DeGrom, J.D. Martinez, Seth Lugo, New Age Performers, Gunnar Henderson, and Seiya Suzuki. And last pack, box number one, we got Diaz, Beto, Oscar Collis, Ornelas, Casey Schmidt, Clay Holmes, Hayden Wineski. We got Randy Rosarena for another short print, and Reese Olsen. So first box, did get a buyback. We got two whites. Uh, we did get a base Ellie. We got the Riley Green variation. One chrome card. <clears throat> uh, the Reed Detmers to 575. And then the Andres Jimenez. So, all right. So we get box number two. Like I said, hopefully we can get one auto. Actually, two. It would be nice if we can get a hot box. Another, bo uh, another box topper, uh, buyback, Dennis Blair. Uh, this will go to the Nationals. What's a buyback? Uh, Penguin Pack asks. So what they do is they, with the buybacks, uh, they took me ages to uh, top load 2K. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say, yeah, I would say it would take you a long time to do that. Two cases, holy cow. Uh, basically, what they do is they take a uh, card from the year that they were. They'll buy it back. Um, it's kind of like what they do with like signature, uh, some of the archive signature series with like the legends and then the uh, uh, the current players and stuff like that. Uh, 
basically also what they're doing with the buyback program for Topps Chrome, uh, where they, you know, basically will buy the cards back and then recirculate them, basically. So these would be like the buybacks. Yeah, and I was finding multiple fine surface scratches on most of the cards once I put bright lights on them. Hopefully, the majority is clean. Uh, yeah, I mean, I ha I'd have to look at them more closely, really. Um, I mean, you know, there's so many times just going through anything. There's scratches on a lot of the products nowadays, unfortunately, and it's just kind of common occurrence or with the print lines and and such. I mean, there's just so much uh, imperfections nowadays. It's just. I don't, I don't want to say it's expected, but, you know, it kind of is almost. We got Oswald Peraza, Amaya, Herbre, Herzog, Bobby Witt, Josh Lau, Jack uh, Sawinski. We got Then and Now, uh, Jim Palmer, Blake Snell. Like I said, they'll go to the Padres and Zach Eflin. Help sell the uh, the high grade cards. Um, I mean, I, I don't know if it really adds too too much to it. We got Kyle Harrison, Seeger, Yastrzemski, Jose Ferra, Rosario, Kepler, Drew Rasmussen. Then we got Jordan Hicks, uh, short print, and then Jordan Wicks behind that for the Cubs. I mean, usually, like, especially, like, the box toppers with the uh, the buyback cards with this product, um, usually there's not too many, like, big names, usually. I mean, there, there might be a little bit, but it's mostly players that, you know, usually a lot of people aren't too familiar with, like Dennis Blair. Jeez, uh, he has... He pitched in 22 career games. For, well, actually, no, I take that back. Well, he pitched for 22 games up until then. So, I mean, realistically, I, probably the rookie year. Called up uh, during 74. Dennis Enter's starting rotation held four complete games with a shutout. He possessed... Uh, actually, this could have been his rookie card, maybe. I'm not too sure. My knowledge on 75 is not the uh, not the best, other than uh, George Brett. We got Dane Dunning, Drew Rahm, Max Meyer, McClanahan, LeMahieu, Jack Flaherty. And there is our second relic, Peraza and Garrett Mitchell. That one snuck up on me. Yeah, I mean, 75, I mean, that was, uh, that was a little before my time. I mean... Personally, I was born in 83, not to age myself, but, uh, you know, so definitely still a little bit before my time. We got Whit Merrifields. Uh, we got Yastrzemski and Cepeda, uh, most valuable players for 1967. Uh, World Series Game 5, Joey Votto, Colossae, Bogarts, A.J. Puck, Bryce Harper, New Age Performers, and Arcia. Yep, old man. Yep. Yep. We got Freddie Freeman, Brian De La Cruz, Forrest Wall. We got Earn Run Average Leaders, which that will be Blake Snell, Smith Shoyer, Tucker, Lamont Wade. Then we got Jaron Duran. Uh, that's a short print. And Boba Shet. That one looks uh, a little be, looks to be a little uh, miscut top to bottom. We got Brandon Marsh, Luis Matos. We got ninety nine most valuable players: uh, Pudge and Chipper, Acuna, Alex Manoa. O'Neill Cruz, Alex Call, we got a white, Michael Lorenzen, and Rosario. Heard somebody say old man. <laughs> uh, what the crook? How you doing? Hope you're doing well. 
We got Nick Allen, Tyler Soderstrom, Samad Taylor, Machado, Carlson, Liam Hendricks, Chrome, Ryan Mountcastle. That's going to be the 999 news flashbacks. Construction of the Trans Alaska Pipeline begins. And 1986 most valuable players Mike Schmidt and Roger Clemens. So Mountcastle on the Chrome. Born in 82. Okay. So you got like two years on me. So Orioles. One of the uh, Chromes. Let's see. We got 2009 Most Valuable Players. Pujols and uh, Joe Maurer. Walker Buehler. Charlie Morton. Rafaela. Estevez. John Gray. Craig Kimball. And that's going to be a short print. Uh, Craig Kimball, 400 save for the Phillies. And Lou Bob. This is a short print. 23 highlights. They're all short prints now, I guess, since they changed the uh, format. Appreciate 16 of you in here as well. Sal Frelick. Yeah, 2015 Most Valuable Players, Donaldson and Harper, Pete Alonzo, Alvarez, Newt Barr, Berger, Joe Kelly. We got Kyle Gibson, just a regular base, and Andrew Abbott, rookie. Then we got Alec Thomas, Wade Meckler, Reese Hoskins, Spencer Steer, Starling Marte, Nick Castellanos, Austin Wells, Freddie Freeman, New Age Performers, and Alex Rodriguez and Pools, MVPs for 2005. So. Got Ezekiel Tovar. Torkelson, Nick Gonzalez, rookie. Kyrie Paris. We got 81 most valuable players. Raleigh Fingers, Mike Schmidt. Behind that, 1951 most valuable player. Campanella and uh, that was, yeah, yeah, it was the Yogi Bear. Okay. I was pretty sure about that. Terang. And then we got Luis Garcia. Short print and Marte. We got Lawrence Butler, Nolan Gorman, Kellenick, Andy Rodriguez, Zach Neto, Montgomery, Joe Ryan. We got Brandon Williamson, just the regular base. And then we got Jose Tina. We got Cano, Hunter Goodman, Victory Leaders will be Strider, Corbin Burns, Christian Walker, Ruiz, Nick Lofton, News Flashbacks, Apollo. Test Project, Apollo and Soviet Soyuz, Spacecraft Dock in Orbit. Joe, how you doing? Happy Sunday. And then Altuve. Let's see those real autos are back. Uh, so far, no real autos so far. One of the buybacks, uh, Chrome, Reed Detmers. Two relics, and then we have a image variation on Riley Green. We got Morel, Conforto, Zach Remlard, Cole, Reynolds, Lizardo, Patrick Bailey. We got Tyler Stevenson, short print, and Diaz. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, first two boxes, no autos. Yeah. Get this stack out of the way, make a little room.
All right, let's see what we get next pack. We got Edgar Navarro, Mount Castle, Kikuchi, Jacob Young, Scooball, Leading Fireman, Classe, Basabe, uh, Black Border, Enrique Hernandez for the Dodgers, and Dominic Canzone. Got a Riley Green. Uh, that's not bad. That's not too bad. And then also, too, for anybody that does Open Heritage, uh, right on the back of the numbers, just right above it, I know it's a little hard to see on camera here, but uh, it will tell you what variation it is as well uh, if you're not too sure. So, Or even, too, if you're not too sure if you hit one of the variations because the variations, if you're not familiar with the pictures, which I am not that familiar with these pictures personally, um, you know, if you check all the back of your cards, it will tell you what the variation is too so a little helpful tint for any tip for anybody that's out there opening up this product nico horner david schneider ruiz bryson stott 1959 mvps nelly fox ernie banks clark schmidt bryce miller we got Juan soto and strikeout leaders uh that's gonna go to strider Yeah, I opened up two blasters. I posted the video. Posted a video around six, I think it was like six o'clock. They were okay. Nothing too too crazy out of them. The uh, the hanger box value pack opening was a lot better. Uh, we got World Series twenty twenty three game three. Kershaw, Radon, Elias Diaz, Tyler Rogers, Corey Lee, Chris Stratton, Kodai Singa for the Mets short print, and Rutschman. Hangers, blaster box, or mega box, Walmart, anyone, anyone better than another. So I like the mega boxes at Walmart just because the, you get three of those blue sparkle parallels. I think those are really sharp parallels, in my opinion. I think they're, I think they're probably one of my favorite parallels. Um, my best pull so far has come out of a hanger box for myself. We got Torres, Barrera, Jazz Chisholm. 1980 Most Valuable Players, uh, Schmidt and Brett, Lux, Gregory Soto, Emerson Hancock. We got a white border, Kieber Ruiz for the Nationals, and Logan Webb. But yeah, the Walmart mega boxes, though, have the blue sparkle. The Target mega boxes have the, um, I think it's just like a red border. Yep, blue sparkle. Blue Sparkle is that parallel that they're supposed to have. Three of them. Uh, we got Yoshida, Jose Rodriguez, Owen White. We got Patrick Wisdom, Christian Garcion Strand, Alec Bohm, Woodruff. We got Baseball Flashbacks, Aaron Breaks, Ruth's RBI record, and Justin Martinez. Yeah, I really like the look of those Blue Sparkles. I like, I like the look of them every year. Just something about them I always liked. Uh, runs bad in leaders. Olsen and Tucker, which I'll be honest with you, not too sure. Matt Olsen. Uh, out of 20, 24 Series 1, pulled a green foil Ellie De La Cruz, number 499. Nice pull. It's a very nice pull, Shiloh. We got Harper. Uh, 2023 Most Valuable Players, Otani and Acuna, Akila Williams, Eston Kerstad, Burleson, Mark Kana. Then we got Dean Kramer, Short Print, and Dick Williams. Example of the variation designation on the back. Yeah, sure. So right here, right above the number. It's a little hard to see on camera there, but it'll tell you what kind of variation it is just above the number. Most, most of the time they put it like right, right next to or right above the number. Um, but it is written really small though. It's a little hard to see, but like for like this one, it says image cause it's an image variation. Uh, if it's a black border, it'll say black. 
if it's a white border, it'll say white. Uh, if it's an error, it'll say error. I think it's a, uh, I think if it's a, like a color swap or the, the cover or whatever, um, I forget the name of the parallel exactly or the, uh, the variation. Um, I think it just says color because I think they swap the, the colors. Um, Ozzy Albies, DeLuca, NL Champions, Diamondbacks, Alex Spias, 2014 Most Valuable Players, Trout and Kershaw, uh, Robbie Grossman, Jason DeLay, Joey Wendell, almost looked like something was written on there, just a little too high, but nope. We got Michael Harris. But yeah, usually, uh, at least in the hobby boxes, second to last card should be your hit. If it's an insert, if it's a short print, if you just have a base card, I would definitely check the back of that base card just to play it safe. Because like, for example, the Riley Green was not flipped around. Uh, we got Juan Soto, Anthony Volpe, Swanson, Oviedo, Vaughn Grisham, Jordan Romano, Devin Williams, New Age Performers, Austin Riley, and TJ Friedel. All right, two packs left. Uh, no problem, Shala. We got Blake Rutherford. World Series 2023 Game 1. Braxton Garrett. Weston Wilson. Cal Raleigh. Tanner Beebe. Brady Singer. And Gary Sanchez on the image, or no, I'm sorry, the short print, and Mason Wynn, rookie. All right, last pack, box number two. Tristan Casa. Avaldi. D-Clan Creon. Riley Green, yeah, so then that's what the regular Riley Green card would look like. Uh, Trevor Larnich, Anthony Descafani, Shane Bieber. We got Brandon Nimmo. And just the regular base. And Trey Turner. So, all right. Box number three, and then we'll be calling it a night. Appreciate you guys hanging out on a Sunday night. Little heritage break. All right. Let's see. Box topper. All right. We do get one of the uh, oversized cards. Ron Grudery for the Yankees. Just check my cards from the blast. There was no variations. Okay. So oversized box topper. Ron Grudery. I'll be going to the Yankees. And uh, Dan. Dan, Yankees being one of the two teams he snagged. All right. Can we at least get an auto? Actually, it would be cooler, too, if we could get a hot box. All right. Let's see what we get. Pack number one. We got 67 most valuable players, Stremski and Sapea. Or, yeah, Sapea. Uh, Freeman, De La Cruz, Trout and Kershaw, MVPs. Swanson, Brady Singer, Anthony Descafani, Shane Bieber. Just a regular base, but we do get our second Ellie De La Cruz. Bottom of that one, same thing. A little rough, but. Uh, I don't think it looks as bad as the first one. Yeah, I um, with the uh, the little bit of retail that I've opened up so far, which has been literally two blasters, two hangers, and two uh, value packs. I think I got two two white parallels. Uh, the black the black border parallels they are hobby exclusive. If I'm not mistaken. Or at least they usually they always they usually are. Um, I got two white parallels, no other variations. Uh, we got Brandon Marsh, Luis Matos, Oviedo, Vaughn Grisham, Braxton Garrett, Nimmo, Josh Lau, Kershaw, New Age Performers, 
And we got 1997 Most Valuable Players, Larry Walker, Ken Griffey Jr. Uh, we got Pudge and Chipper again, MVP card. Nick Allen, Weston Wilson, Riley Green, Swinski, Rosario, Max Kepler. We got Freddie Peralta on the short print. And Tony Gonsolin. We got Soderstrom. We got Maurer and Pujols MVP from 2009. Walker Buehler, Larnich, Ibre, Rasmus, McClanahan, DJ LeMayhew, Curtis Mead behind that. Mayhew, just a regular base card. We got South Relic. 2015 Most Valuable Players, Harper and Donaldson. Herzog, Bobby Witt, Shremsky, Jack Flaherty, Xander Bogarts. Baseball Flashbacks, Route. Yao breaks Mel Ott's 47-year-old record. We actually hit that, I think, in the last box. And then we got Pete Crow Armstrong. This is, uh, this is one of those rookies I'm looking forward to seeing play. Very, very sad that the Mets traded him away for that, that Javi Baez deal. We got Pete Alonzo, Alec Thomas, it's fair. Uh, we got World Series Game 5, A.J. Puck, Smith Schoiver, Kyle Tucker. Then we got Rowdy Telez for the Brewers, short print, and Queen Priester. We got Lawrence Butler, Nolan Gorman. Forest Wall, Earn Run Average Leaders, Snell, Acuna, Alex Cole, Dylan Carlson, Justin Steele, New Age Performers, and Real Muto. We got Kellenick, Devin Sweet, Alex Manoa, Simon Taylor, Liam Hendricks, Estevez, Yoshida, and Yoshida is going to be an image variation. I was pretty sure about that. I was like, that image looks different. So Red Sox with the image variation, Yoshida. I know they were uh, they were a little bit of a late grab. Then we got Aaron Savale, uh, short print. And Gavin Williams. I forget, was that Paul? I think had the red took the Red Sox. We got Dusty Baker, Castillo, Valdez, Machado, Charlie Morton, John Gray, Craig Kimball. We got a white Blake Sable. And 2006 most valuable players. Uh, Ryan Howard and is that Justin Menard? Yeah, yep. I thought that was. It was that little lull of a uh, time where I was not collecting sports cards. We got Hamilton, rookie. We got Rizzo, Rafella, Alvarez, Newt Bar, Burger. Joe Kelly, we got Then and Now, Cunha and Morgan. Like I said, these will go to the current day player. And CJ Crone. We got Scherzer, Diaz, Beto, Marte, Gonzalez, uh, Raleigh Fingers, and Mike Schmidt. M uh, MVPs, uh, Yogi Berra, Campanella, MVPs, Bryce Terang, 
and Wab Wa uh, Julio Pablo Martinez. Excuse me. We got Ruiz and Acuna, stolen base leaders. Manessis, Paris, Andy Rodriguez, Zach Neto, Montgomery, Joe Ryan, Machado on the New Age Performers, and Nolan Jones, Rookie Cup. Got Moustakis, Ryder Ryan, Zach Giloff, Trout and Bellinger, MVP, Brandon Williamson, Brad Hand, Nick Madrigal, another Kodai Senga short print, and Ryan Weathers. So two Senga short prints. I can't wait for him to at least get back for the Mets. We got Austin Riley, Gossman, Parker Meadows, D.L. Hall, Josh Young, Cole Reagans, Hunter Green, Marco Luciano, and that is just the regular base and winnings for the Braves. We got Yelich, Darvish, Selby, Verdugo, Brent Rooker, Perdomo, Andrew Heaney, Flashbacks, Bush Gardens Theme Park opens, and Julio. All right, got about half the box left. We got Mantle and Aaron, 57 MVP. Auto in three packs, hopefully. Cabrera, Angel Felipe, Yogi Bear, Suez, Martinez, Seth Lugo, Dean Kramer on the short print, and Jordan Alvarez. Would be nice if we can get at least one auto. Max Mayer, Merrifield, Williams, CPS, Devin Williams, Cal Raleigh, Tanner Beebe, David Bednar on the short print, and Austin Meadows. Feels like we got some. We got Murphy, Johan Rojas, Reese Hoskins, Spencer Steer, Kyle Gibson, Nick Castellanos, Austin Wells, rookie Tyler Stevenson. I saw that purple up top and it threw me for a loop. Uh, and Tyler Wells. I don't know for some reason it threw me for a loop when I saw it on the back side of the pack. So, so far, no Dominguez, no Evan Carters. Got two Ellies. We got Wade Meckler, Tovar, Torkelson, Vado, Classe, Lamont Wade Jr., O'Neill Cruz, and we got an auto. We at least got an auto. I saw the name, though. Uh, let's see, we got 2013 uh, Most Valuable Players, uh, Pirates and Tiger, uh, McCutcheon and Cabrera. And then our auto, Tigers, Reese Olsen, on-card auto. Don't think it's numbered. So Tigers getting an auto. So Tigers getting a uh, auto and a variation of Riley Green. 
I said auto in three packs, didn't I? I think, uh, I want to say we went five packs. I think it took like five packs, but still, you did call the auto. And all right, let's see what's in the rest of the box. Should get, I hope we should be getting at least one Chrome card, I would think. Volpe, Blake Rutherford, uh, World Series Game 1, Ruiz, Soto, Hancock, Okay, yeah, it was close. Definitely close. Alec Baum. Oh, and then, all right, well, here's... That is to 75. Marlins. Luis Arias. Chrome to 75. Black. 32 out of 75. So, nice little no low-numbered Chrome. And Salvador Perez. We got Tristan Casa. Evaldi. Stop. We got most valuable players. Nelly Fox, Ernie Banks for 59. Carlos Radome. Brandon Woodruff. Jazz Chisholm. Adley Rutschman. Oh, what do we got here? Jazz Chisholm for the Marlins. Missing signature. Black Chromes are nice. Yeah, the Black Chromes are really sharp. So Jazz Chisholm, Marlins, back-to-back -back hits. Missing signature on the Jazz Chisholm. I almost missed it, and I decided to check it one last second. So a little missing signature on the Jazz for the Marlins. Marlins with back-to-back -back hits. Rutschman. And Kyle Bradish. We got Deacon Cronin. Peraza. Elias Diaz. We got 1980 MVP, Brett and Schmidt. Heston Kerstad. Alec Burleson. Mark Kana. We got Connor Joe. Short print. And Chanel. Yeah, the black chromes are sharp. They definitely are. We got Miguel Amaya, Kyle Harrison, Seeger, Lux, Owen White, Robbie Grossman. Delay, and Mar Marlins with another uh, parallel, and Bello on the base, Jake Berger on the white uh, parallel. Yeah, same thing, says white, white border on the back. And very last pack of the night. Once again, I appreciate you guys joining, appreciate you guys hanging out. We got Dane Dunning, Drew Rom, Wisdom, Carcion Strand, uh, 2023 MVP, uh, Otani and Acuna, Joey Wendell, Jordan Romano, Sony launches Betamax in Japan, and Hassan Kim, base. Uh, like I said, the flashbacks, I'm just going to throw them in with one of the random teams. Uh, I'm just going to do it personally at random. Um, no sense to really do a whole random for them, in my opinion. Um, but Marcion Strand. So, quick little recap. Uh, we got a white border, Jake Berger. Jazz Chisholm, no name. Uh, Detmers to 575. Holzman, uh, buyback. Yoshida, variation. Ellie de la Cruz base. Black, Enrique Hernandez. Mountcastle to 999. Dennis Blair buyback, Cole Reagan's white, Deli Cru Ellie Dela Cruz base. Uh, we got the black, Luis Sarais, the 75. Andres Jimenez, Oswald Peraza are two relics. So at least we got at least one auto. Uh, Reese Olsen was our, our only auto, rookie pitcher. Riley Green, image variation, and Ron Goudry on the box topper to uh finish out that break so um i don't know overall not 
not bad, not great. Definitely think they could have been a little bit better, but uh, um, yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, Heritage, it's tough. It's a tough product. There's a lot of base cards. I mean, you got technically you got 500 base cards. 400 of them are a little more circulated. So you know, hitting parallels of certain players with the big checklist definitely could be a little tough. Pretty much just got to get lucky with the autos or the relics or if you get one of like the dual auto slack relics or, you know, any of that kind of stuff, anything numbered. So, um, I don't know. We may, we might do a little retail break of this. Maybe we'll see. Uh, we'll see how we're feeling. Um, I think if anything, maybe a couple of mega boxes, maybe, but we'll see. Um, I don't know if you guys are interested in a retail break, shoot me a DM on Instagram. Um, you know, especially if I get, a, if I get a bunch of people that are looking for it, then, uh, you know, we'll maybe roll with it. Um, I haven't really watched enough retail to see if retail is worth it. Um, you know, sample size wise, I mean, a little bit that I've opened up, it's okay. I wouldn't say it's great, but I wouldn't say, I'm say, wouldn't say it's bad. Uh, Walker says I'm done till Bowman. Okay. Don't blame you. I mean, usually Bowman's one of the one of the products I usually like to drop a little extra money around uh, myself. So, but with that, I want to thank you guys for joining. Appreciate you guys for filling this break. Uh, you know, appreciate you guys if you're just hanging out or if you're part participated. And uh, like I said, we will see you guys next time. Take care, everybody. Have a great you know rest of your Sunday night, and have a good one.